God, this side of my nose is just the ugliest. Look at the difference between like this side of my nose. It's like, I look like a, f I can't stand it. It's like, it's a different human being. I can't even explain it. What is that stuff? Like, oh my god. Okay, like for real. Okay, I gotta tell you guys something. It's so annoying. Like, I just need to show you this. There's so much I should like. Okay. How come? <laughs> and I can't look at myself. I'm the ugliest person ever. Okay. How come I go like this? Like. Up close, I look so good, right? Like, shut up. We know I can say that. Like, normalize being able to say that if it's the truth. If you're, if, just stop, stop, okay? But then, if I like walk back here, like, how ugly? I look like the ugliest person. Like, why am I so ugly? I don't get it. Like, like what happened? Well, I'm like the ugliest person I've ever seen in my life. But like, up here, I'm okay, right? I don't even really like the way I look today. I feel like I need to put on some more bronzer. Something's wrong with me. I don't love myself right now. Okay, where's my brush? Hold on. Okay, do I look more on now? Not like that. Like, I just like, I'm like not the prettiest person today. I have like a zit right here. Okay, um, so, hey, all right, you guys, last week was a fucking, like, I don't wanna talk about it. It was so bad with like the camera situation. You guys know if you haven't been watching on Instagram that um, you'll know. I can't look at myself right now. I'm so ugly. Um, okay, but I did this video and it was like the best video ever. So the problem is, is that I'm going to like basically not try to like, I'm not going to recreate it because I, I can't do that. But like, I'm going to try and like kind of remember the things that I brought up and talk about them again. I have like, okay, I'm like really not feeling myself right now. Like, I just don't like the way I look. What the fuck is wrong with me? Someone help me. Okay, hold on. Ew, like I'm so ugly. Why am I so ugly today? Hold on, what? I don't like this angle. Like what's wrong with me? For the lighting? Ew, like what's wrong with me? Can you tell me the truth? Okay, so actually I probably know the truth. Like, okay. I um, never do this because El Pollo Loco, their food always makes me really fat. Like they have, I think there's just so much sodium and I think I'm like swollen. Um, so last night I got off work late and I was like not wanting to come home to like cook. So I drove to El Pollo Loco and I got a like two piece like, like breast and wing meal and with like the sides and shit. And it was probably, it was like probably a lot of calories, but it's not even the calories in that food. It's like so much fucking salt. Like I don't feel it actually. I just like look it, like I can feel that like I look like puffy right like is that the problem like i'm not fat i'm gonna show you guys later i'm just really white um and it's disgusting so i'm gonna actually but i will i will like show you guys i'm not fat later because i'm gonna show you guys my bag and shit um but why okay i know this whole intro has been about me being ugly but it's what it is like see at least gonna be honest like i'm not even cute today like it's just not like something's wrong with you today okay Anyway, I'm gonna talk about oh, yeah, so I'm not going I hate Starbucks now like it's not that I don't, I don't even care about anything about except is the coloring in here the lighting here is really fucking ugly man I, Can I just like no stop I can't do this. Hold on. Like I really can't do this. Why am I so ugly in that video? Like I see I'm better here, right? Like this is better. I'm gonna sit down here. Like I just feel so ugly Like why I look better here? So I'm not ugly, actually. I guess that was like a really bad lighting. Like the lighting makes me look like I'm dead, like a fucking corpse. Okay, let me just sit here and tell you guys quick. I can't think that I want, I need to make coffee. I haven't had coffee today. So um, I, I am like over Starbucks because I don't like their drinks anymore. Like I don't like it, okay? Like the only drink I like is that strawberry one, but I'm kind of done with it. Like how many more fucking months can I get that fucking strawberry drink? So I like don't have another recipe I like. I don't like anything else. So I am over it. Like I'm just done with it, okay? But yesterday, the thing is like, I have sometimes for like my commute to work, I have to have a fucking, like something to drink. You know what I mean? Like some fucking caffeine. So I was like stopped yesterday or two, a couple days ago. And I like stopped there. This one that's really annoying, honestly, 
and I was like, fuck, I don't have a fucking mask. Like, and then so I was like talking to someone on the phone and they're like, you actually don't need a mask anymore. Did you hear that only the people who work there have to wear the masks? Like customers don't anymore. So I was like, oh, okay, cool. I'm going to go in and they're going to kick me right out. Watch. So I go in there. They didn't say shit to me. And like, for real, they're like, the, Starbucks will like make the biggest scene if you don't have a mask. Like it's so obnoxious. Like these people, it is like crazy as fuck. They're like completely indoctrinated. But, um, so I went in and I didn't have a mask on and they didn't say anything to me. So, um, and they, that's like a really annoying story too. So I know for sure, like things like, I don't think you have to wear masks anymore. Like you don't like, that's a policy. I already read it. I already know about it. Okay. Um, anyway, it wasn't, anyway, I don't like their, it's not even about that. Like, I don't like their drinks anymore. So I don't know what, see how ugly I am here. Like the lighting is just so fucking fugly. I'm the ugliest person in the whole world. Like this is the ugliest lighting. Okay. So now that we've established, I'm not that ugly right now. Like I've proven to you guys that I'm not that ugly. Oh my God. I think I'm the ugliest person. Stop. I need to make a fucking coffee, bottom line, stop. Okay, um, I need to make a coffee, and I don't like anything anymore. Like, I don't know what to do. Um, I've been, like, I'm really into, like, vanilla lattes right now with less milk, but, um, I'm gonna try, I'm gonna do this. I did this, so, last week it was actually really fun because I'd never tried this before, and I tried it with you guys, and it was so good. So, I'm not gonna, like, I'm not gonna like pretend to like do something. You know what I mean? I don't put on like shows, you know what I mean? So basically this last week that I showed you guys on the video that didn't go, didn't upload, whatever, I showed you this and it was really good. So um there's that and um yo, who are you? So nice. Okay, I'm gonna get ice. Okay, um yeah. so I'm gonna make this coffee and the, th the truth, oh, I already have a spoon here. Um, I, I don't know, like it's a, it's a, um, um, I don't, I'm not like a fucking, this is, I don't do tutorials on here. If you don't know how to make a fucking frappe, um, that's on you, like leave me alone. So I'm just using my frappe stuff. Like I'm not doing a, a fucking tutorial. Like how do you not know how to make this? Like you live under a rock. Um, okay, so there's that. And plus I'm like, in a really bad mood because it's like lighting is so ugly. I can't even look at myself. So um, this, and then I'm gonna put some water in it. Actually, I have water here from earlier. I'm just gonna use this. It's not probably not enough. Um, I'm gonna get my water. Do I have water in it? Like, my whole house is like a mess. You guys know that from the construction, so. I have no water. <laughs> no, I do. I just don't. Just a long story. So, that's not enough. It's like, are you guys like me? Like, if you're ugly, you like, don't even care. Like, oh my god, this is the ugliest video ever. There's that. Um, then I'm gonna get my little whisk thing. Okay, I'm gonna whip this. But um, to be honest, this whole video is gonna be mostly about this secret recipe that I have that like looking like this, I should never be showing you because I'm like making myself sick to my stomach. Okay, um, I love this recipe. It's like this recipe that I used to make when I was really fat. And um, it's from Barefoot Contessa. Like, I hate myself. I'm like, who does that? You're like fucking fat ass and you're like cooking, making Barefoot Contessa food. Like, where do you get off? It's so sick. Like, I, like first problem right there, you know what I mean? So I always remember this like simple recipe and I love it so much, but I never, I never do it. And I never do it the way she did, does it because she's like, makes the fattest food ever. Um, and so I have like a low, like a lower calorie, like, better version of it that, that ends up being the best thing ever. So I wanna share that with you guys. And it's something that like I, you guys know I'm like really protective over anything I do. Like if, you know what I mean? I, like I have to like kind of like get to like the mindset of being able to share or, you know, I don't, I don't know what it is, let me shut up. So this is the frappe right now and I'm gonna put in this coconut creamer and it's this Coffee Mate coconut cream. Okay, it's 35 calories in a fucking tablespoon which is a lot, so, you know, I know you can like pour it, whatever, you gotta be careful, it's a lot of calories, but, it, ugh, so many, okay. Um, it's, that's what it looks like. It's actually really good. When I tasted it with you guys last time, because I hadn't actually, I just kind of like made something up, because I don't really, I don't really go to Starbucks anymore. Um, it's really, really good. So if you like frappes, and you like a little bit of like flavor cream in your frappe, I really, really like this. So go try that definitely 
like nice for an iced coffee during the day. Put this away. Um, I'm gonna get into some list things with you guys, but I need to move the camera because the only thing, oh my God, do you like this? Okay, my God, look at me. Why is that? Why am I like the ugliest person from over here? I swear to God, whenever I meet someone, I'm gonna be like this close to them now. I'm gonna have to do that because like, I really am like ugly right now. What the fuck is that? What the fuck is that? A fucking zit on my nose. I'm like, okay. Um, I got this from um, West Elm and it's like something for wine and then like this little like, it's probably like ice or snacks, a snack bowl, yeah. And then this tray. So I know you guys were asking about it on my Instagram, I haven't been blocked. Okay, anyway, I'm gonna preheat the oven because this recipe, needs, it's like, we're actually doing a recipe. I don't like, it's not like cooking. It's something that's really easy. I'm not fat, I will show you later, I'm not fat. It's just, I'm really white and I don't work out. So it's like, you guys know that. Um, no, I don't. Don't, no, I do not. Okay, no, I do not work out. So shut the fuck up, it's not your fucking business. I hate working out, I hate physical activity, you know that shit. Um, I'm sorry, like, I can get away looking like a fucking million bucks, bitch, and not work out. Yes, I can. Shut up. Okay. Don't piss me off. I fucking hate working out. Okay, let's talk. I'm so excited to show you guys this series. Okay, can I move you? It's once again, it's like when I come closer, it's like pretty. It's like prettier, right? And I go back and it gets like like gray. What is wrong with this phone? Oh my god, it's a little bit gray right now too. Like it's just like not the cutest. What the fuck's going on? Okay, um shut up. Okay, so um, I'm gonna, okay, I have a I have a couple things on my list while I'm waiting for like the oven to preheat. I should be making the I should be making the food right now, but I kind of want to do like one. I have to like rant about. I have two things I want to rant about. Um, okay, and the first thing is like you guys are going to slit my my throat. Like I know you're going to, but the thing is that you can't because I swear to God it's true. Just stop right now. Stop. Stop right the fuck now. I'm gonna stop you and dead in your tracks because you're going to piss me off with your bullshit. And I hate the way you guys spin everything and act like I am completely and totally insane. I am like the most upfront, honest person ever, okay? Like, okay, I don't even know how to start this because I actually, you guys are going to paint me out as being crazy. You're gonna spin it and be like, oh my God, the bitch actually thinks that she is the only one who smokes in the whole world. Okay, stop right now. Like, I can't with you because I actually have a very, I'm actually very like level-headed and I'm not crazy even though I may come off as, as crazy. Um, okay, so when did I start? I don't care what you say. Like, I don't even care what you say. The truth is this, like, okay, let's just get it out. When did I start like smoking on here? I would probably say like maybe like two, uh, no, it, okay. When did I start hardcore, like, okay, this the cigar and stuff, that was like two or three years ago, right? Okay cigars and stuff like that that's me like i'm sorry anyone like don't you know what i mean if you're gonna smoke a cigar like like now like please okay but what i'm talking about more is the cigarettes how come like all of a sudden ever since that little like when i did my video of me just sitting in my house smoking and like listening to my music and i was like i will have a cigarette if i'd like to have a motherfucking cigarette like don't fuck it like that I forget what I said, but it was something like that. Like, leave me the fuck alone. Like, excuse me. I can't have a fucking motherfucking cigarette. Are you serious? Like, who the fuck are you? Um, so ever since that little clip has been passed around, like, viral, um, now, I'm sorry, but, like, it's like I put everyone in their place about not giving people shit about having a motherfucking cigarette. And now my, my oven's, like, broken, too. Like, it just turned off. Like, it just really turned off. <laughs> Okay, I know this is the thing, like me saying this is really, like it's gonna come off as obnoxious to you guys, but you are dumb, okay? How come now all of a sudden I see people like smoking on Instagram or like, you know, and it's like like bigger people, you know what I mean? Not like, 
not like someone like no followers. I'm seeing bitches out there like posting photos with cigarettes or whatever. Like I know everyone's gonna start sending me pictures or videos of people smoking cigarettes from like two years ago and stuff, but just stop it right now. I'm stopping you right now before you look stupid. Don't question me. Don't fucking question me ever. I'm always right. Don't fucking question me. I did not see anyone having the nerve to fucking smoke because people, if you fucking, if, if I, if I touch my fucking eyebrow, okay, people come for you, okay? You can't do anything on here, let alone smoke a fucking cigarette because some fucking dumb fucking Karen ass bitches will come and be like, oh my God, you're the worst influence ever. Like, what the fuck? I can't even have a fucking cigarette. People go fucking like crazy as fuck. I don't get it. It's so annoying. So you think, you think that people, you think that people who actually give a fuck what other people say are going to start smoking. All of a sudden they start smoking. Like it's just something is, whole, is weird about the whole thing to me that all of a sudden now I'm like turn on Instagram or something. And like, there's people smoking like a cigarette. I'm sorry. Like, let's not even lie right now. I, the thing is like, I tweeted the other day that I put someone, I was like, I literally put like the world in their place by telling everyone the way I do to get the fuck off of my jock and just, I will have a cigarette if I'd like to have a fucking cigarette, shut the fuck up. Like if you can't handle that, you need to jump off a fucking cliff. You know what I mean? So the, because I said that, I feel like it's like kind of like giving people like a little bit of like a breathing room to be able to smoke a fucking cigarette if they'd like to smoke a fucking cigarette as it is their fucking goddamn choice in this fucking free ass fucking world right now, okay, bitch, okay? So anyway, I'm really pissed about that because I know I'm gonna come off as crazy, but it's just suspect, bitch, okay? It's just suspect, like, don't you think so? I know you're never gonna give me the credit for it, I know. I know you fucking assholes out there will never give me the credit, but it's the truth. Like now, right, all of a sudden, all of a fucking sudden, like people are smoking cigarettes on Instagram or like whatever, like, I don't know what posing with fucking, with, with cigarettes, like all the fucking damn sudden. I'm not saying that you didn't smoke cigarettes before, but like you didn't have the nerve to post that shit until maybe my video you saw of me telling everyone to shut the fuck up, got your fucking balls out, bitch, to be able to fucking smoke a cigarette. Cause that's what happened, bitch. I'm the one who paved the way for your little pussy ass to be able to have a cigarette on Instagram if you'd goddamn like to. And that's the truth right there, okay? It takes me a second to get it out, but that's what it was. It's like, I paved the way because you're a pussy, okay? To be able to fucking have a cigarette on Instagram. That's what it is. It was me, it was me, and you know it, okay? If you're going to come at me and tell me it wasn't me, you are wrong, okay? If, if you wanna talk, talk about the eyeliner, that's also another thing. Shut up, okay? I'm not saying I invented it, you fucking dumb fuck, okay? I'm not saying I invented it, I never said I invented it. I did not invent this, I already know, I told you, I took it from like Sophia Loren and like altered it a little bit, and was in, I was inspired by old movies, dumbass, okay? And you're gonna come on here and tell me that, oh my God, she thinks she invented, no. I started wearing this eyeliner first. Yes, I did, okay? If you're gonna come for me and lie and try to fucking act like I didn't, then you're just like such a fucking hater and you're dumb, okay? Because I, this is, I fucking did this, okay? Chanel, okay, Chanel, yeah, don't. Okay. Yeah, I'm brushing my hair in my kitchen, don't. Okay, this is the thing. Don't come for me. It's like, I'm over you guys. You know you know about the rules about I'm in my own fucking kitchen. This is not a goddamn restaurant. Yes, I can put my fucking hair everywhere if I like to. It's my fucking food. Fucking weirdos. You're so weird. So fucking weird. Okay. My kitchen is not going to know that. Oh, did you see that this, this fits now? I didn't show you guys. So they're, okay, never mind. The, it's, everything's going. It might, the whole, the house should be done fairly soon. Okay, um, let me get the bread. Okay, so this bread is like a recipe that I love from like when I was fat. It was like one of those things that when I had like, when we had like company over or something, I always wanted to like make this bread. This is like when I was like growing up with like my family or whatever. And um, I like couldn't wait to make this bread because it's like the best thing ever. But now I do like a low-cal version of it so that I can enjoy it every once in a while. Um, and I haven't made it in a long time. I haven't made it in a long time because my life now, okay, hold on, what in the, oh, okay. I thought my wing came off. Okay, wait, hold on. I'm gonna like bend down so I want you guys to like be able to see what I'm doing, okay. So um, I, um, my life is like, like really different now and I told you guys if I wish I could share like what my, how my life is different. I wish I could share like what I feel right now. I wish I could share 
like just so much with you, but I can't. And like, I was not able to enjoy things in my life for a very long time just because I couldn't, you know what I mean? Like whatever, it's like a long story. Um, and like, I never thought that I would be able to, I don't know, I don't wanna talk a lot about it, but anyway, I've, I've never I was never able to enjoy this bread, period. Okay, I wasn't able to. Now I'm able to enjoy this bread and um, that's why I make, I've been making a lot lately, okay? So anyway, I'm gonna share it with you right now. Here we go. So I'm not gonna share, actually, I'll just tell you. So it's like the Aladdin bread, okay? You know this, I call it like the Aladdin bread because it looks like the, the bread that like the monkey steals in Aladdin, right? Okay, so this is the Aladdin bread and ugh, so ugly, oh my God, I can't. I know, I, this is the thing. I know I've said it a million times. You don't have to comment it in the comments. I don't give a fuck, okay? You're dumb. Do you think I don't know that I've been saying I'm ugly the whole time brushing my hair? Do you think that I don't know that? Like, do not. God, you guys make me so mad, okay. Um, stop. So, but you have to get the Aladdin bread. This is from like Pavilions or whatever Ralph's. It's the one they make there like in-house, right? You guys know it. You have to get this bread. It's the big French bread, isn't it? Yeah, okay, it's a big French bread loaf. Okay, let me show you what it looks like. So it looks like this. Okay, now I'm gonna cut it. Let me get my shit out to cut it. Everything, every every step of this, every ingredient of this is really important. Okay, oh my God, stop. Where's my brush? I'm never gonna get through this video. I need to go, I can't like be ugly, I'm sorry. Like I can't, it really bothers the fuck out of me. Okay, so I'm gonna get this and I'm gonna get my cutting board out. Here. All right, so cutting board. Mm. I forgot to tell you guys. So we're starting Memorial Day early, HRH. The whole site is 10% off and is double promo, free shipping on all US orders. So you don't have to do a minimum or whatever to get free shipping and 10% off. So definitely take advantage of that. Um, the code is M-E-M-10, Memorial 10, M-E-M-10. I'll put it down, and I think I'm going to do it until Tuesday. So take advantage of that. 10% is a lot, plus the free shipping. Okay. So anyway, let me show you guys this, and I'm going to show you how I cut it. Okay, so I don't, let me show you how much to cut. I'm just going to do two pieces because it's just for me, um, and it's fattening. Like, this bread is so good, but it's just really fattening. Okay, so you have to cut it like this, this thick, and then you gotta cut it again in half. All right, so it's gonna be like this. Um, it's just like that, okay? And then I have the end too, and I'm just gonna do the same thing to the end. But usually I would like fill this, I have this thing, and I would like fill it up, like so I'd have like four pieces, okay? All right, now I'm gonna get the olive oil spray. And uh, this is the thing, I'm so annoyed by you right now, because Um, you're gonna be like, this is the thing. Don't, this is, this is bothers me so much is that this is a, yes, this is a simple recipe, I get it. It's a simple recipe, but you didn't do it before. So don't, don't come here and tell me, don't come here, it's, first of all, it's rude, and I've told you guys that multiple times. It's very rude, okay, when someone is show, showing you something that they do, and then you're like, I already did that, I, I, I do that too. No you don't, bitch, okay, no you don't. I am so honestly, honest to God, sick of that shit. Don't fucking try and like take what I do and act like it's like you do that too, because you don't. You might do it a similar version, but you haven't done it like this, bitch. So stop. No, honestly, I'm sick of it. Like I, to be honest, like I'm really over that. It's like actually just very bad manners to do that to like someone's like showing you something. Oh my god, like I do that too. Like you're such a fucking brown noser. Like who who acts like that? Like why do you act like a brown noser? So I'm gonna spray both of these sides like that. Okay. And then I just kind of like rub them around and that's it. Okay, that, that's all for now. Don't worry, I'm gonna, I, I will come back and show you guys. So I'm gonna put them in the fucking oven, okay? You guys are like laughing at, you guys are laughing at this recipe and then you're gonna go do it and you've never done it before. Okay. Let that sit. Okay, now I'm gonna take you guys into the other room because I want to do a um, see, I'm, I'm actually not fat. I just like, it's so white and gross that like, I, what can I do? There's no sun out right now. Like, I don't have time to lay out and there's no sun. All right. Mmm. What is this? Look what I got. 
Aren't these cute? So remember my mom got me the, the creamer and the sugar thing? So I got these, I really like them. I feel like they're so, um, like uh, 90s Barbie. Okay, let's see where we're at now. All right, so here is me, and here is me, I am not fat. Okay, I just wanted to, hold on, let me move this. Okay, I'm not fat. I just wanted to show you guys a fat check with you because I want you guys to always gonna call me fat. Okay, and I'm not saying I'm like the skinniest because I'm not the skinniest. It's just that I, oh my God, why am I blurry now? Why is it a filter? The fuck is wrong with fucking camera? Yeah, I don't know what's wrong with this camera. This is the new 12, you guys, and it's like the settings are just like weird. I don't know what the fuck's wrong with it. Okay. Let me sit here with you because, oh my God, this is a beautiful lighting, isn't it? It's like, this is like the best lighting ever. Like, what would I do if I didn't have this amazing lighting? Like, oh my God, I look like a painting right now. I look like a filter. Like, I literally look like a filter. I have a filter on my face. Like, why are you putting a filter on my face? Okay, before we get started, I have some, some students, some A plus students I wanna give awards to, I'm not kidding. So do you remember when I asked you assholes out there to like, please send me gum because I'm dying. Like, I need gum. Like, I don't have, I can't get that gum here in the States. I have four A plus students who I'd like to fucking give mentions to because I really thank you guys so much. Anne is from Ireland, actually. They sent me, I don't know who sent who, which one sent which ones because um, Judy opened the box. I don't know which one. They sent me like bricks of these fucking gum packs that I need and you guys like saved my life. Like one of the reasons I'm skinny, I, I was able to lose weight is because of that gum. I just love that gum so much. I really hate the way I look like I'm really ugly. And then the next one is Aaron. <laughs> he said, see you in class. I know, I love it. Okay, the next one is Jack. And I read all the notes. I just don't want to read them aloud, okay? And the next one is Shelly. So I really, um, all of these students immediately uh, get A in class. So no matter what, and they get A's in class. And I'm gonna save all these notes, of course. So thank you guys so much for helping me with that. Like, I honestly thank you guys so fucking much. You have no idea. Okay. So yeah, see, why can't everyone be like these students? Like, it's not that hard, you guys are rude, okay. Um, anyway, I am the ugliest person. Like, what am I gonna even do? Like, I can't sit here, I'm so ugly. We gotta find another spot. Okay, I think this might be the next best thing. And I don't, don't, okay, I'm also gonna stop you right there because I already know you're gonna make fun of the cords. You don't know what's going on, so shut up. All right, anyway, I, I have to like defend myself about everything. There's like a mark on the wall and you guys will like say some weird shit. So you won't even let me get to my point until I like clear the air. It's so fucking weird. Like leave me the fuck alone. You guys nitpick me about everything. Okay. So, um, all right. I am going to start off by, I'm going to start off with the fat talk for a second because I'm going to, you guys are going to like yell at me. Where's my brush? You guys are going to yell at me. And, um, where's my coffee? Hold on. Where's my coffee? Okay, here we go. Okay, so, um, okay. I'm sorry, I cannot like rant unless I feel good about myself. And there's this, this camera is like really on like another, another planet right now as far as trying to make me look like shit. Like, I'm honestly gonna beat its ass. Okay, um, so I'm gonna get to the fat talk for a second and I'm gonna have to always tell you guys that um, that drawer is open, it's really ugly. I know, my kitchen's not done yet, as you can see. <sighs> okay, this is the thing. I was fat and therefore I have the right to speak about this t subject if I motherfucking like you bitch, okay? So shut up right now. If you're gonna be offended that I'm speaking about my opinions on 
a certain thing that I'm right about, then you can fuck off right now and get the fuck off my channel, okay? I was fat, okay, and I'm traumatized by having been fat. I know in my future it's a possibility that if I don't like always, you know, I really have this the like the, the opinion or the the thing in my head. I I think that being fat is like being overweight is the same thing as being a drug addict, okay? I really think so. It's something that you have to if you have like the fat gene, I call it, you have to always I'm always thinking about eating, always, but I have to make the decision not to eat, okay? Just like drug addicts. They have to make, they think about the drug, the drug all the time. They have to make the decision not to have the drug, right? Okay, this is my personal opinion on it, and that's why I'm allowed to speak about it. If I motherfucking please shut the fuck up, okay? Don't piss me off. Here we go. When I was fat, yes, I was really hard on myself. I hated being fat. It was the worst thing in the world, but... um Thankfully, I'm not anymore, as you can see. Okay, so I was also very aware. I was hyper aware of what like looks like shit on me and what doesn't. There are a lot of fat people out there who don't get it. Okay, like there's some things that you just cannot like bag. I'm talking about bags. I'm talking about clothes. There's bags out there that will make you look fatter. And you guys can go to my old videos when I was fat. And I talk about how bags make me look fat. It's true. There are certain bags that make your fat ass look fat. Okay, shut up. I'm gonna take some of this shit out so we can see. Oh, isn't this cute? This is my sweet shop chain. I love it with my key on it. Okay, that. And then um, on my other key, I have this sweet shop chain. Okay, um, I'm just gonna take it out so you guys can see it closed properly because it's like a fucking mess right now. All right, so here it goes. You're gonna be offended and I don't care. Okay, because I'm right and I'm helping you. Um, and I'm calling it out, like, as a former fatty, I'm allowed to say whatever the fuck I'd like to say. Um, because if I wasn't fat and I was talking I was talking like this, it would come off like really dumb or really bad or just stupid. But I have like the opinion that if you've been through something and you've like, whatever, come out of it, then you can talk about it, okay? So this is the thing, bitch. If you're fat, you cannot get this bag, period. I'm telling you right now, don't. It just looks like shit, okay. But I'm going to help you if you want the bag and you're fat. All right, here we go. Here's the bag. This bag is the baguette. You guys know I got it for my birthday. And it should only be worn high like this. Or I'll show you another way because now they have like the long straps they sell and stuff. Okay, so it should only be worn like this. High and close to your body with like a small shirt. Okay, like this is the point. This will make, see how I put my arm down? It looks like fat, right? Don't even do that. Like, make sure that your arm is not like that so it pushes down. Like, even though I don't have like fat arms, like if you push your arm down, it will look fat, right? Just be like mellow like that and like don't be fat, okay? Okay, so if you're like this, it's like so cute like this. I'm also going to call you out on the fat settings, okay? This bag has fat settings. This is a skinny setting, the medium setting, and the fat setting. It's the truth, bitch. If you're having to wear this on the third setting, you're probably too big for the bag. It probably makes you look fat. When I was fat, I, this bag would never have looked good on me. It doesn't look good on a fat person, period. Okay, but now Fendi is putting on these, um, these rings here because they're selling straps for your bag, right? So if you are fat and you want to wear this bag, but you know that you can't wear this bag, it just looks like, it looks, does not look good on a fat girl, okay? It doesn't, shut up. Just shut up, okay? I'm so sick. I can just see you guys getting all fucking pissy at me. Shut up, it's true, okay? You need to wear a longer strap, okay? If you're fat, you need to just put this thing down, okay? Put this down. And now Fendi is selling straps, or you can buy mine, which is better, obviously. It's so cute. This is the medium one. I also sell a longer one or I can do a custom link, whatever you want. This is the medium and I think it's so chic, so cute, but then you don't look fat, okay? Don't wear the bag on the fat setting, bitch. Like, I'm gonna know. Like, everyone's gonna know that you're wearing it on the third setting. Like, oh my God, like, you shouldn't need that. You know what I mean? Like, to be honest, you shouldn't need that. It has to be on the small one. So I wear mine like this with a chain down. I feel like it adds so much to it. I think it's so cute. It's like that really nice, thick, heavy, sparkly glossy chain that I use on so many of my designs but um so that's that 
it's on the skinny setting, of course, with room to spare, with room to spare. I mean, not as much as everyone. I'm not saying I'm like skinny, that's the thing. I'm not saying I'm like the skinniest person in the world. I'm actually not even like skinny. See, I can admit it. I just am like, I will never work out. I hate working out. It's like when I work out, I like my, like my teeth hurt. Like I get like so angry that I'm working out. I hate it. Like there's something about it. It like infuriates me. Like I hate it. I don't want to work out. Like the thing is like now it's like, what if I start getting like really flabby? Cause I'm like getting older. Like bitch, I don't fucking know. I don't know what to do. I'm not working out. Like who cares? Like I think I'm going to work out. Like fine. I'll work out like once a week, but like that doesn't do anything. You have to work out three times a week. Like no. So I just like know what to wear. I know it looks good on me and I like whatever. And it's like, I'm not working out. Like I, 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 I'm just scared. Like, but I'm going to have to work out, but I'm not working out. Okay. Um, it doesn't like it doesn't get golden brown enough you have to put it on 375 oh sorry if you put it on 350 it doesn't get golden brown enough you have to put 375 so i didn't do that fuck so i just turned it on 400 to see if it'll start cooking more i promise it's worth it just wait okay so there's something that made me totally cringe and it always makes me cringe and i wanted to bring it up because it's just i'm like so embarrassed i don't even like I don't even fuck around um, with anyone on like TikTok or whatever because it's just like it's so like bottom of the barrel. I feel like um, so anyway, I just post things on there basically to just infuriate people. <laughs> That's what I do. Like I'm the kind of person that I will not like. I don't smooth things over. I'll just throw a bomb on it and it'll just like explode. Um, That's just how I do. It's like if like if you push me, then I'll just make it explode even more. Okay. So, um, this is the thing. Oh yeah, it is the wrong color. Look at the Hermes, look at the Hermes box. Now we know. See, I'm not ugly. Like, dude, look at that. It's like a fucking brown tint to it. Like a gray tint. Um, that I'm not, I swear to God, like I'm not ugly. It's just like, what in the actual fuck? This is so bad. I'm, I, I swear to God, fuck this shit, man. This doesn't, this is not how I look. Like it's bringing up all of like the gray, like my freckles, but in, like a bad way and just making me look fucking nasty as fuck. Okay, stop. Um, why? Stupid fuck. Okay, um, here we go. So, dude, um, but that's not, oh, okay, should we check? Let me see. This is what they look like. And they look way more burnt in here because the color is off on this fucking camera. So stupid. Okay, so then after that, I'm gonna take, do you guys remember that salt? Do you guys remember that salt that I got from um, TJ Maxx? It's the pink Himalayan salt that you crack. So then you take that and you put a lot of salt like cracked salt on it when it's still hot, okay? And just like move it around. Okay, let me get a plate so I can have a bite with you guys. I'm just gonna have one right now, but I'll bring them all, actually I'll just put them all in here. Okay, so the way Barefoot Contessa used to do them, just so you guys know, um, is she, would like put olive oil, like drench them in olive oil and butter or something. Okay, it was olive oil, but drench them with like, you know, like the, um, the lat, like with the brush and it was like soaked, but you don't need it. Okay, so let me show you what it looks like with the cracked salt, okay? 
So the inside is soft and the outside is like crunchy and like salty and a little bit olive oily. It's so good. So it's just like the best. It's the easiest shit ever, but I swear to God, you don't realize how good it is. Make it like I made it. It's so good. Mm. Okay, so this is basically a dress like these fucking psychotic Karens out there. Um, let me eat. Sorry. Okay, I don't, I don't care. This is my mouth. This is my mouth. It's not your mouth. Like, you don't do that. You guys are so fucking irritating, man. Like, I go, like, go out and, like, suck random dicks, and then you tell me you don't put your finger in your mouth. Shut the fuck up. All right. So. Ugh, this coloring is so atrocious. I don't even know what to do anymore. Like, I'm like, I can't even look at myself. Okay. Nasal drip through pissing me off. Like, you're really pissing me off right now because I'm going to start this rant. Oh, my God, my nose is dripping. All right. Stop. Okay. Um, I am so sick of this bullshit with, like, okay. 